just in from the NFL, Commissioner Roger Goodell announcing tougher punishments for players convicted of domestic violence. Now this stems from that case involving Baltimore Ravens Ray Rice and what many saw as a weak punishment. Sports Director Tim Brandt joins us now with details on this. Tim. Commissioner came out strong, six game offense, six mm -hmm. game suspension for the first offense and then a lifetime ban for the second. So he's putting his foot down. I'm calling this the Ray Rice rule and make no mistake about it. Commissioner Roger Goodell is making a statement and trying to clean up the terrible reputation of the NFL. Ray Rice got a slap on the wrist for physically assaulting his wife and a two game suspension basically said, hey, that's not too bad. Well, the outcry was heard loud and clear on Park Avenue. Goodell says the public response to Rice showed him that the NFL is held to a much higher standard. Yesterday, Browns wide receiver Josh Gordon was suspended for the entire season because he violated the league drug policy, testing positive for marijuana. Today, the NFL announced a much stronger policy for domestic violence and assault. Again, the offenders will receive a six game suspension for the first offense, lifetime banishment for the second. Let me put this in perspective for you. The two game suspension for Ray Rice is exactly what Brandon Merriweather of the Skins got for a high tackle on Torrey Smith. The commissioner was wrong. He knows he was wrong, and today he made some serious changes. But it's too late for Ray Rice's case. It is. His his suspension is going to be two games. That stays as it was. Right. All right. Okay. Good step forward, okay. though.